Hello, and thank you for joining me and investing your time to learn more about our Bite Size Azure series. My name is Jason Lambert. I'm Cloud Technical Consultant for Microsoft Azure at Ingram Micro. And today I'm looking to answer the question, what is Microsoft Azure? Many of you are not familiar with the fact that Microsoft Azure is actually two distinct platforms. The first would be infrastructure as a service. It's the ability for you to deliver compute, storage, network, backup, and DR services to your customers. The second is a fully managed platform as a service to deliver and develop solutions for applications to your customers, both in cloud and mobile. Now that we've understood the what, I'd like to understand or explain the why. As you're probably familiar, Microsoft, or sorry, cloud computing is a global phenomenon. Today, more customers than ever are asking to move their workloads and their servers and storage into the cloud and or provide or find applications that are developed in the cloud. It's the ability for a customer to transition from a capital expenditure where they have to pay up front for their services to an operational model where they can pay as they go. It's for the who is what verticals are we looking to uh, take advantage of? Really anybody is available or able to get into cloud computing. It doesn't matter whether they're in the medical, the legal, the retail, the manufacturing, production, uh, 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 verticals, all those verticals, all those customers uh, can take advantage of cloud computing today. And the how is by having open and integrated platforms to be able to develop and, and provision services. And the fantastic thing about um, Microsoft Azure is its ability to be hybrid. What that means is you have customers that have on-premises infrastructure and depending on what they what makes most sense to them, they can either move their entire infrastructure into Microsoft Azure, or they could decide to move pieces of their infrastructure into Microsoft Azure and have, a, have a, an experience with applications that are both on premises and residing in the cloud. Microsoft is king at both on premises uh, operating systems when we understand Windows Server um, 2008, 2012, and now the new launch of 2016, and those applications are also delivered to our customers in Microsoft Azure. Now finally, almost finally, the where. Microsoft Azure is a global organization. It's a global infrastructure, and it has platforms across the entire planet. In the United States alone, Microsoft in US has five regions. They'd be U.S. West, U.S. East, U.S. North, Central, and U.S. South. And we just were thrilled this past year that Microsoft launched Canada Central and Canada East. This last screen is to suggest to you that Microsoft has a, a very robust offering out to our customers. Initially on the infrastructure of the platform side, I give you a high level understanding of what those services are. To drill down into more detail, this website is a great place to go. As you can see across the top of the screen, um, there's a link uh, in the bottom of the video that will actually get you to the site. And as you click on these blue boxes, it is a great tool to enable you to understand what the services are at a high level. Also, it will get you links to the pages that matter most. So as you're understanding or wanting to understand more about pricing or SLA or documentation to discover those services, you'd be able to get that from this page. Thank you for joining me today, and I look forward to talking with you again uh, in the coming videos.